Two different bags, both are honestly really good, but let's get into a bit of the differences and help you figure out which is the right one for you. The Day Chaser bag, it can actually carry quite a bit of weight in it. It's got this harness system, so it doesn't really feel like it's that much weight on your shoulders. Swing the bag around, you can access the camera compartment super fast. I can pull out an extra camera body if I want to, full-size water bottle. This top section opens up here. Small things like a charger when I'm traveling. Top pouch here, pretty big. Anything I want to grab really quickly. Laptop section on the side. The camera compartment itself, you can actually configure it in a bunch of different ways. The Alex Stroll Mountain Light Bag. It weighs just over two pounds, so it's really lightweight on your shoulders. Side of the bag here, tripod or whatever else you need to bring. Bottle holder as well. Open this up, and it's a traditional top-loading backpack. The camera compartment is down here at the bottom. You're gonna need an ICU system to hold your camera. Use it as a camera bag, or you could just use it as a backpacking bag. So both bags have really comfortable harnesses. They both have chest straps. Both have waist straps. If you guys wanna learn more about these bags, go over to our website. There's also a sale going on right now.